Hello, and welcome to the anniversary edition of FCF Church News. I'm Gio. And I'm Yvette. This church is about following Jesus and sharing God's love. In this special edition, we want to share to you all the highlights from last year's FCF Church News and events. So sit back, relax, but don't fall asleep as we present to you the latest updates on what's happening here on FCF Church News. How long have you been attending FCF Church? Almost three years. That's been a while. Well, everyone has a different story to share about FCF Church. I have personally met the Lord because of this church. Yeah, and come to think of it, this church started off as a small gathering. Five families, two civilians, including senior pastor Willie Bosecco, were part of the founding members of FCF. The group continued to meet regularly for Bible study and be involved in the Assemblies of God for almost a year, until God made a way for them to be able to have their own service on the third Sunday of January 1992, which was held at G45 building, Jones Memorial Chapel. During that time, there were a lot of contacts or residents living off base who also wanted to attend the service. Since it was difficult to accommodate or escort them every Sunday, the group decided to have two services, one off base where they rented a place at Sogo Fukishi Kaika, meeting every morning and other service on base. The setup of the Navy life made the members of the church come and go. This church has been a training ground for so many that when they were assigned to another country, they gained that perspective of being inside a ministry or in some cases, starting their own ministry if the need arises. Last year, we focused on three series. Those include the Moses series, Experiencing God, and Restoring the Joy, a study of Philippians. In the Moses series, Pastor Willie highlighted the love-hate relationship between Moses and the Pharaoh, the relationship between God and the Israelites, and most importantly, the key lessons we learned from the Exodus experience. Being convicted of our sins is not the same as being saved from our sins. You can sit in a service with tears streaming down your face because of the deep conviction of your sins. But that does not save you. Experiencing God is part of our Friday Bible study series. Through this series, it personally helped me to know the power of God through prayer, the church, circumstances, and reading the Bible. We invite you to come to Bible study with us every Friday as we study and experience the power of God. This year, we are excited to learn more about God's Word from our upcoming Sunday series and continuation of experiencing God. From the lessons we learned last year, we could declare that God is our healer, God is our provider, but most importantly, God is our refuge and strength. That is, by the way, this year's anniversary theme. We are not just confined to the four corners of this church. If you notice, in the past year, FCF was pretty outgoing. We attended a retreat in Yamanaka and participated in a concert held by Franklin Graham Ministries and Hillsong United in Tokyo. As agents of change, we have also been reaching out to Japanese residents through our creative language learning. We ask volunteers to teach English to Japanese residents every Thursday at the Shogo Fukushikaikon right beside the Dae Mall. People say that success is just a numbers game. So let's talk about the achievements of FCF Church through the following numbers. 424. That is the number of likes we have on our Facebook page. I highly encourage all of you to like, share our photos, and share our Facebook page with all your friends. 6. The number of kids dedicated to the Lord. A child dedication is a ceremony in which the parents, including their relatives and guardians, commit their child and submit it to God's will and to raise the child according to God's ways. Two. Two fellow believers were baptized last year. Congratulations, Mickey and Drea. Water baptism is a promise or covenant we make to follow Jesus Christ through our lives. This ordinance or ceremony suggests burial and rebirth, symbolizing the end of our old life and the beginning of a new life 
as a follower of Jesus Christ. Eight, the number of ministries and fellowships we have at FCF Church. Men's Fellowship, Women's Fellowship, Youth Fellowship, Kids Ministry, Worship Team, Media Team, Dance Ministry, and Ushering Ministry. 10. The churches and organizations that FCF support, such as the Trust in the Lord Foundation in Manila, Back to the Bible Philippines, Philippine Council for Evangelical Churches, Japan Evangelical Association, The Emmanuel Project in Virginia, USA, The World Venture in USA, God is Alive Christian Ministries in Nueva Ecija, Zamboanga City Emmanuel Christian Fellowship, Jesus Christ Mighty Deliverer Las Piñas, and the First Baptist Church San Fernando La Union. Thank you for watching. ATS Church. Yes. I see you right here. Bye bye. <laughs>